Hi everyone, I'm Twyla with Natrona County Library and I'm here in the Crawford room at the library today because we can't have programs here right now, but I thought I'd come in here and share a program that we might do here, but that we could share with you at home. And today's project is called Ball Blaster and it comes from a book called Kid Concoctions, Weird, Wacky and Wild Stuff You Can Make at Home and it's written by John E. and Danita Thomas, okay? So, what you're gonna need for this project is some tape, a pair of scissors, two toilet paper rolls, lots of, we have lots of these in our house right now, right? A piece of plastic wrap, yeah, just good old saran wrap or whatever. About a two inch rubber band, not too big, not too small. And four paper clips. So to start with, you're gonna take one of your toilet paper rolls and you're gonna cut it lengthwise all the way through. Just like that, okay? And then you're gonna kind of scrunch together, overlapping it, and then just make sure that it fits easily into the other two, like this, okay? You got it the right size, then you're gonna take your tape and tape it together. And I'm going to put the extra one in the middle just to make sure it holds. Then you're going to take your plastic wrap, put it over one end of that tube, get it kind of tight on there, and then you're going to take and tape all the way around that to hold it on. So now you have this tape together and you have your piece of plastic on this end. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take two of your paper clips and you're going to put two, uh, two of them on opposite sides on the end that doesn't have plastic on it. Just like that, okay. Then you're gonna take your other toilet paper tube and you're gonna put your other two paper clips opposite of one another, one on one side, one on the other side, like that. Then you're gonna take your rubber band and you're going to attach it to one of the paper clips. You might have to loop it up on it a little bit. Get your rubber band clipped on there like that. Then take your other two, put the um, end that has plastic on the inside first. And then you're going to connect it, the rubber band, to the paper clip on the other two. This one takes a little more finagling. <laughs> Almost got it. Ta da! Got it! Okay. And there is your ball blaster. Okay? So. <clears throat> How it works, you can take a ping pong ball or any other ball that's about that size. You don't want it too heavy. 
and you put it on the inside opposite this is going to be your shooter right here this is your boom okay and you're going to put your ball in there pull back on your the inside one and let it go Whoa. and i found sometimes it takes a little bit of practice to get it to go very far there it goes ta-da a ball blaster you can have fun with it you can play some games with it try to hit a waste basket or a clothes basket or maybe set up a little obstacle course that you can try for so have fun with that and for now i'll say bye bye until next time have fun <laughs>